So to play the black sheep come home intro chant, you need an E major chord. You take your index finger, 3rd string, 1st fret, middle finger, 5th string, 2nd fret, and ring finger, 4th string, 2nd fret. After that, we have another intro. This one is just E minor. So you take your index finger, 5th string, 2nd fret, middle finger, 4th string, 2nd fret. So to play that guitar part, your left hand just keeps the chord shape and your right hand plays the 6th string and 4th string. So for the verse, we need E minor. We play this for 12 counts, then G major. Your index finger, 5th string, 2nd fret, middle finger, 6th string, 3rd fret, ring finger, 1st string, 3rd fret. This one for 4 counts, and we play these two chords for 3 rounds. After playing that for 3 times, you need E minor 12 counts again, then a B minor bar chord. So you take your index finger, you bar the 1st until 5th string, 2nd fret, middle finger, 2nd string, 3rd fret, ring finger, 4th string, 4th fret, and pinky, 3rd string, 4th fret. Also for 4 counts. So whenever you play the E minor chord, you can palm mute. So your left hand just keeps that chord shape and your right hand is resting your palm on the strings of the guitar. If I lift it off, if I rest on it, so you just keep your hand in this position. So after muting the E minor chord, we play the G major and B minor chord openly like this. All down strokes. So when you count the verses, you don't need to count it one by one like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. You just count the bars like this. 1, 2, 3, 4. So remember the verse is E minor, G major. We do that 3 times, then E minor, B minor. So for the chorus, we need all of the chords we learned just now and one new one. So G major, B minor, E minor, and a new one, D major. So you take your index finger, 3rd string, 2nd fret, middle finger, 1st string, 2nd fret, ring finger, 2nd string, 3rd fret. So we play all of these chords for 2 rounds, and each chord we play it for 4 counts. So I'm going to show you a pattern. Down, down, up, up, down, up. Down, down, up, up, down, up. Da, 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 da. And two and three and four and so when you make it faster, it sounds like this. Da 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 da. Let's try the chorus. I'll send you my love. So that's the chorus. So for the post-chorus, which is this part, we need more or less the same chords as just now. So G major, B minor. E minor and B minor. So it's the same like before, each chord for four counts, it looks like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. And that's basically the whole song. If you want to end this song on a weird, creepy note, then you play an E minor chord. To make it happy, then choose a G major. So that was Scott Pilgrim Black Sheep. If you like this lesson, you learned something, then like and subscribe, check out all of my other videos. If not, tell that to the cleaning lady on Monday. Because you'll be dust by Monday. The cleaning lady, she dust on Monday. Wait, today is Friday, right? <laughs>